Hello, I'm Katie from Midnight Music and this is the first video in a series of Audacity Tips for Music Teachers. In the five-part video series, we'll look at how to edit existing audio files, including how to shorten a song, how to create a fade-in or fade-out, how to change the key or tempo of a song, how to remove a chorus or verse, and how to remove vocals. The first thing you'll need to do is import your audio track from your computer hard drive. To do that, go to File, Import, and choose Audio. Locate the audio file on your computer, select it, and click Open. Wait for a moment while Audacity processes the file. Not all audio files will import successfully. Some purchased songs are digitally protected and you may not be able to edit them in Audacity. A few playback tips. You can playback the song using the playback controls at the top of the screen but you'll work much faster if you learn just a few shortcuts. You can use the spacebar to start and stop playback. And press the letter P if you want to pause playback. If you'd like to start playback in the middle of the song, you can click on the blue waveform and then press spacebar. You can also listen to a small section of the song by clicking and dragging your mouse over part of the waveform to select it, and then press spacebar to play the selection. Other useful shortcuts include pressing the home key to move the playback cursor to the start, and the end key to move the playback cursor to the end of the track. To download a list of these shortcuts, you can visit midnightmusic.com.au forward slash audacity shortcuts.